How's it going everybody? This is Jose from the Stock Market 101 channel and I hope you guys are having a great day. And today we're going to go over my Robinhood portfolio for this week and let's see how it did. Okay, we're on the Robinhood app and as you can see here, we're up 0.48% today, which is $42.42. And for this week, it's just been pretty much stagnant with a 1.14% gain, which is $100. And let's check out our stocks real quick first up we have apple and as you can see apple is up actually apple is down 1.14 percent today and for the week it is up 1.13 percent and as you can see here i have eight shares with a total equity of 1787.60 and my total return right now is 366 dollars 36 cents which is 25 percent i believe apple's going to keep growing its value and its profits because of the new phone that just came out the iphone 10r it's a bit cheaper than the other ones Next one we have here is Amazon, which is down about 1% today. And I have two shares with the total equity of $3,940. And I do have a nice total return of 16.52% so far, which is $558.79. There was this article that I was reading online about whether or not Amazon or Alibaba is a better buy. And I think I'm going to be going over that in, another, in a future video. Next one I have here is NVIDIA. It currently is at $276.40, with it being up 1.88% today, which is $5.09. And I have a total of six shares, which is a total equity of $1,658. And I'm up nicely 26%, which is $342.19. Next one I have here is Facebook. And right now it's at $162.15 and it's been down 0.93% this week. And in total I am down 8% which is $42.36. It isn't that bad, I want to continue adding more shares to Facebook, especially right now since if you look at the past 3 months it is down 16%. And I believe it's going to go back to its all time highs and keep going higher. Next one I have here is Tesla. I have five shares and down 2.18%. So far, which is $32.83. I wanna learn how to swing trade this stock once I have more capital in my account. Then I have here is Microsoft, which is at $113.32. And right now it is up 0.41%. I have three shares currently with an equity of $339.96 and I'm up 14.74% which is $43.68. I believe in Microsoft, Microsoft's going to be probably right after Amazon hits the trillion, it's going to be Microsoft hits the trillion dollar market cap or Google, do either one of those. But the next one I have here is Abby which is at $95.69, down 2.5% in the past three months at least. It is up a little bit, which is 0.75%. I have eight shares, total equity of $765.53, and I'm down 4.39% so far. And I plan to hold this on for many years. The next one I have here is Boeing, and for the past week it is up 2.96%, which is nice. And this stock just continues to outperform the market as it is up 284% in the past five years. And I have two shares, total equity of $719.69, and have a total return of $26.41, which is 3.81%. The next one here I have is Alibaba, which is at $164.65. And for the past week, it is up 3.85%, which is nice because I think for the past year, it's been going basically down. It is down 7.45% past three months, down 19.75%. Alibaba, I believe, is basically the Amazon of China. And currently, I have seven shares. Total equity of 11.52.55. And I'm down... 12.13% which is $159.11 and I plan to add more and I plan to add more shares to my account. 
Next one I have here is AGNC, which is a real estate investment trust. And currently it's at 1889. I don't really have this for capital appreciation. I just have this for the dividend yield, which is monthly. And right now I have 22 shares, total equity of $415.58. And total return 1.32% down, which is $5.56. Uh, I really have this video so the dividend yield as you can see here which is 10.7% and it does have a potential to give out a little bit of return as you can see in the five year chart it is up 52.85% which is basically 10% every year which is decent. The next one I have here is Canopy Growth which is at $47 it went up 7.08% the other day which is $3.12. And it's been hit hard recently, and I don't really know why, because it's pretty much the, one of the top companies in the marijuana industry. But I do have three shares, which is a super small position. As you can see here, it is at 0.95% of my portfolio diversity, and I have a total equity of $141. I am up 2.9%, even with a huge dip, which is just $3.98. And the next one I have here is Aurora Cannabis, which is at $6.53, up 2% from the past week. I have 11 shares, which is a total equity of $71.83, and I'm down 5.22%, which is $3.96. I have these two because I believe that these companies will grow in size in the future, as it is like a rising industry. But I do, I do believe it's super high risk right now, so I'm just gonna slowly add more shares. And that's the basic update for this week for my portfolio. I hope you guys enjoyed this, and please, if you have any video suggestions, leave them down in the comments. I love interacting with you guys, and I always respond. And other than that, please drop a like, subscribe, and turn post notifications on, and I'll see you guys in the next one.